myself, Kato. Now today we are going to talk about measure of time again. Now, in this lesson, I'm going to explain how to convert from week into days, year into months, and week into hours. Right? So it says convert 5 week 4 day into number of days. So this equals to how many number of days? Right? Basically it means that how many days are there in 5 week 4 day? Right? So, <clears throat> again as I explained you in the previous video, first you always check which unit is bigger and which unit is smaller. Right? So, if you are confused whether to multiply or divide, then always remember SPD and BSM. Right? So, in this case, week and days. Right? Which is bigger? This is bigger. Right? And this is smaller. Right? So, bigger to smaller, always multiply. Right? So, 5 week. Right? So, 5 week. In 5 week, how many days is that? Right? So, we know 1 week equals to 7 days. 1 week equals to 7 days. So, 5 week means 5 is multiplied, right? So, 5 into 7, right? So, 5 seven are 30. 30 days. 30 days, right? And there is 4 day here, right? 4 day. So, plus 4 day. Sorry, 5 seven to 35, right? Sorry, I'm sorry. So, 35 plus 4 equals to 39 days. Right? So, how many days is there in 5 week? 4 days. There are 39 days in 5 week. 4 days. Okay? When such question is given, first, you don't need to convert this into days. You are converting into days, right? So, this is already into days. So, first convert this unit into day, right? Week and day is different unit, right? So, convert week into days and then day, day plus day. This 4 day, right? So, 5 week means 35 days plus 4 day. You get 39 day, okay? And this is how you are supposed to do when you are converting from week into days, okay? Now, next example. Next is, you are supposed to convert, it says, how many months of 30 days are there in one year? Three months, right? You are convert into months. So, means, again, this is here, this is month. So, this is bigger and this is smaller, right? B, S, M, right? So, means you need to multiply, right? <clears throat> so, one year equals to 12 months. You are converting from year into months, right? So, <coughs> it says the months of 30 days, okay? So, <coughs> uh, <coughs> so one year, right? So, one year. In one year, how many months is there? 12 months, right? So, one year equals to 1 into 12, okay? 12. 12 it become months okay <clears throat> now there are 12 months right equals to 12 months okay next is three months right three months so three months is already there right so three right so plus three plus equals to 15 right so so how many months are there in one year? Three months. They are 15 months in one year, three months. Okay? And this is how you are supposed to do. Okay? <clears throat> Next. How many hours are there in one week? Three days. Right, so how many hours are there in one week? Three days. So again, look at here. This is week and this is hours. Which unit is bigger? This is bigger and this is smaller. PS, M, right? 
so first you need to convert this is a week right we don't know how many weeks are how many hours a day in one week right but we know how many hours are there in one day right so first you need to convert this week into days and then we are going to convert days into hours okay <clears throat> so one day one day is equals to 24 hours okay <clears throat> So one week, right? Uh, <clears throat> one week, right? Equals to seven days, right? One week equals to seven days, and three days is already here, plus three days. Equals to how many days there? Nine. Sorry, 10, right? 10 days. 10 days, right? Now, one day equals to 24 hours, right? Then, if in one day, if there are 24 hours, then 10 day, how many hours is there? You are converting from bigger to smaller. This into hours, right? Day bigger to smaller. Right, so multiply, right? So 10 days equals to how many hours is that, right? So 10 day into 24, right? 24, it will become hours, right? So you'll get 240 hours, okay? And this how you are supposed to do. So I hope you enjoy this lesson and I'll see you more in the next video. Thank you.